Metro Transit has a new plan reducing the number of cars on each train from three to two. Agency leaders believe this could solve issues facing the light rail system, including costs. Ben Henry tells us all about it. For many, it's how they get from A to B. You ride the train frequently? I do ride the train frequently. Uh, it's really convenient. Casey Peterson rides the Green Line to work in Minneapolis and back home to St. Paul. Is this your train? This is my train, yeah. Before hopping on, he tells us he's on board with Metro Transit's new plan. Starting Saturday, April 13th. This weekend, light rail trains will roll with two cars instead of three. As we're making this switch. Metro Transit says the longevity of cars and maintenance costs are key in this move. Less wear and tear. Less wear and tear. Arriving at Target Field Station. For now, two train cars will only run on the weekends. Chief Operating Officer Brian Funk calls it right sizing adding they feel fewer cars currently fits the number of riders. Our ridership still is not at the same levels it was before COVID. Uh, when we accumulate all those additional miles, there's a lot of expenses that go along with it. Weekends are uh, quite a bit lower than weekday on Green Line. Funk telling the Met Council in a meeting this week that ridership on the Blue Line is down a third compared to 2019, and ridership on the Green Line not much better. Looking forward to hear how this goes. This isn't the first time they've rolled out two car trains. In 2022, it was to address riders' safety. And while that's not the main focus now, Funk says fewer cars will help with their new onboard agent program. When they have fewer doors to check, two cars per train, they're able to be a lot more efficient and hopefully provide that good visibility for our customers that we know people are looking for. Metro Transit says on busy weekends, perhaps with large events, they will be ready and it's quickly uh, transitioning over to those three car trains. They also say that this puts them in line with the goal they have of reaching a stop every 10 minutes. Right now that is at 15 minutes, telling us that the more frequent service they have, the fewer cars needed per trip. Live in Minneapolis, Ben Henry, 5 Witness News. Thanks, Ben.